Hi everyone! In this week's video, I will prepare a healthy bread. Well, I can also call it like nutritional bread or nutrition bread because it's very good for your body and it's very easy to digest also. And it's made with this flour, the white one, it's T80 or T800. This one is spelt flour, wholemeal spelt, wholemeal rye, wholemeal with sourdough. This one is very ready, you can see so many bubbles, salt, water. And to finish, I will add this seed. So we have sunflower and linseed. So that's why it's a very healthy bread because, well, you have lots of seed, very good for your body and very good flour too. And lots of lava, of course. You will get the recipe in the description of the video. And if you have any more questions, just go in the comment. Now I'm gonna mix. So I start to pour the water. So why the water first? Well, because Sometimes if you put the flour first, it's gone, the flour is going to stay at the bottom and it's always annoying. Then I can put all the flours. I'm going to add also the levain. So the levain is here. And I forgot to say, but there's also one gram of yeast in this recipe, which is very few. So I'm going to mix. Okay, so we see in four minutes how it looks. And you noticed, of course, that I didn't add the seeds and the salt because I will add the salt at second speed and the seeds when it's completely mixed at the very end. So this is how it looks at the end of the first speed. It's quite sticky, but in the, at the end of the second speed, it shouldn't be sticky at all. So now second speed for maybe seven minutes, eight minutes. And of course, I don't forget to add the salt. So actually it's been five minutes and as you can see, the dough is pretty well mixed. It should be like 23, 24 degrees now. So I'm not going to mix any longer. I'm just going to check the temperature and I will see after this. It's at 23, 24. 24.5, 24.6, that's enough. So now I add the seeds. So I just added the seeds in the bowl. And now I just mix for two minutes in first speed just to have the seeds properly mixed everywhere in the dough. So let's go for two minutes. I just finished the mixing. So the dough is perfect, it's a very soft dough, don't be surprised if you try it. So now I put this dough in a container, I'm gonna let it rest for, for one hour. I will give a fold, another rest for one hour, another fold and shaping, then in the fridge. And the baking will be tomorrow. Here it is. Let's go for, for one hour.
So we are the next day now, and this is the dough. I mean, this is the bread now, how it is, 24 hours later. It's ready to put in the oven. So I put them on the board, and I will cut it shortly. Okay, so to cut the bread, I just take the blade, and 45 degree, and just a sharp and neat cut. And you can see that the cut is nice. So this is the bread, this one. You can bake at 250 degree for like 35 minutes. So this is the two bread after baking. And that's very interesting because there's two things here. First, you can see that the cut is not very well done. And there's two reasons. First, I give one fold yesterday instead of two because, well, just lack of time at work. But even, and second reason, this bread usually don't open. Sometimes you have to accept also in bakeries, some bread, some type of bread, they don't open. Of course, this one has lots of wholemeal flour. It can be because it's rice, pelt, and wheat. And yeah, sometimes it's just like this. So sometimes it just doesn't really look like what you would like to have. But the most important here is the taste. And in a few minutes, I will cut it and you will see inside. But one thing for sure is this bread is really delicious. So yeah, don't really judge this one by his cover, but more by the taste, really. So I really recommend you to try it. So me yesterday, I give one fold with two hours, two hours and a half, and the fold in the middle. But if you give one hour, one fold, one hour, one fold and one hour, it might look a little bit better. So yeah, you should try. I'm gonna ask again, but don't forget to subscribe or like the video if you enjoy it, because it helps me a lot. Okay, so I cut the bread now. So yes, this bread is extremely good. You can see all the seed inside and it's super tasty. So yes, this is the recipe for this bread, this healthy bread, nutritional bread. Thank you for watching the video. Please subscribe and give it a like if you enjoy it and see you next time.